here we have a uh, Blackstone oil analysis kit. I'm going to be sending oil to Blackstone Labs. Uh, this is a collaboration between me and them. The oil in question has 20,000 miles on it. This is probably regular oil, uh, maybe synthetic blend. Here we have the oil sample report for my car, my Hyundai Genesis Coupe. It's a V6. Comments are silver increased this time. It's a bearing metal in some engines, but we're not sure if that's the case for this one. It is slowly trending upward, but at just six parts per million, we're not calling a problem just yet. Iron is still a tad high on a per mile basis, but it's trending downward, and that's what we like to see. The other metals are low and steady. The viscosity is in the 5W20 range, and a trace of fuel is just from normal use as opposed to a fuel system problem. The TBN shows active additive left at 5.4. Resample in 3,000 miles to monitor the increasing silver. Now, the elements in parts per million is this row. This row is the oil sample, um, current one. These are the averages of past oil samples, and these are two past oil samples I've done. Here are the universal averages. You know, the viscosity is good, well within acceptable parameters. Now, here we have the... 20,000 mile oil. Uh, the results are consistent with the oil being in service for too long. Oil will thicken over time and the sample is too thick to measure viscosity. It was too thick to measure viscosity. That is, when I read that I was, um, I wouldn't say impressed, but shocked. The TBN is low at 0.9, so the oil was also depleted of additive. The excess metals are likely from an accumulation over 20,000 miles of use. Universal averages show typical wear for a 2-liter turbo with just 5,700 miles on it. Silicon is also elevated uh, on the oil, um, it says right there. That could be dirt contamination that's adding to metals, or it might even be residual sealers left from break-in, depending on how many oil changes have been done since new. So we can already see aluminum is high, chromium is should be at zero it's at two uh, iron is 130 when it should be at 14 and you can see here just the all these numbers not all of them but a large majority of these numbers are high and for the viscosity they put down just thick that that's that says something you can see here that changing your oil every 20,000 miles is not a good idea Thank you for watching. This was a, a uh, collaboration between me and Blackstone Laboratories. The oil analysis for the 20,000 mile uh, oil change was no charge to me. The My car, though, I did end up paying for. Uh, this, yet again, was an open collab between me and them. So thank you very much for watching.